In this problem, we're told to find the average value of the function on the given interval. So we're told that f of x equals the square root of x, and this is going to be from 0 to 4. So in order to solve this problem, you need to know the formula f sub average, or the average value of f, right, our function. It's going to be equal to 1 over b minus a times the integral from a to b of f of x dx. So this is the formula we're going to use. And so f of x is just our function right here, so square root of x. And then b and a is going to be like this. So a to b, so a is going to be 0, b is going to be uh, 4, so it's just your lower to your upper bound. So now we know that, all we got to do is plug in. So it's going to be equal to 1 over b, which we know is 4, minus 0, because that's a. And then 1 over 4 minus 0 is just 1 over 4, times the integral from a, which is 0, b, which is 4, of f of x, which is the square root of x, times dx. So we can just start by solving the integral of this, and then I'm going to multiply the answer by 1 over 4. So let's solve this integral. If you go ahead and do this, it's going to be, let's just simplify this to, or rewrite it as x to the 1 half. So this is x to the 1 half, and now we need to take the integral of it. So we add 1, so it's going to become x to the 3 over 2. And then we divide by that. So dividing by 3 over 2, it's going to be the inverse. So 2 over 3, x to the 3 over 2. And then we're evaluating it from 0 to 4. So we're going to plug in 4, get a value, subtract whatever 0 is. But uh, when we put 0 in, it's just going to be 0. So essentially, we're just plugging in 4. So if you take 4, plug it in, 4 raised to the 3 over 2 is going to be 8. And then if you want to multiply it by 2 over 3, so 4, it's going to be 2 over 3 times 8. 8 times 2 is 16, so 16 over 3. So we have 16 over 3, and then that's going to be that. And then we plug in 0. 16 over 3 minus 0 is just 16 over 3. So that's going to be the value of this integral. And then we just want to multiply it by 1 over 4. If you go ahead and do this, it's going to be 16 over 12. And then what we can do is divide both, or simplify it by dividing both by 4. So 16 divided by 4 is just 4. 12 divided by 4 is 3. So this right here is going to be answer. So your answer to this problem is going to be 4 over 3. And hopefully you found this useful.